Four years ago, six European organizations joined the Multipoint project to develop a femtosecond laser system to support aerospace manufacturing processes, both economically and environmentally. The main goal of the, of the multipoint prototype was to demonstrate uh, that, uh, that we can improve the results that we obtain with more conventional technologies. Is it able to uh, look for a new techno uh, laser technology uh, with which we can micro-drill large samples, maintaining the production rate, but avoiding uh, post-processing, mechanical etching and polishing? And the answer to that question is yes. Over the first year, uh, we spent a lot of time by uh, designing and uh, doing the conception of such a uh, challenging laser. Big challenge for us is uh, that uh, together with uh, high power, you have high thermal load. So you have thermal instability into the system that you have to get rid of it or manage it. Uh, thanks to all the sensors that we placed inside the system, we can monitor a lot of data and check step by step inside the system that everything works uh, as expected. And so I've been in charge of basically doing the whole optical design, so how to handle the beam in which uh, lenses arrangement and then uh, conceiving the mechanical uh, modules, ordering the parts and uh, putting it together basically. The constraints was to have a whole fitting module that's compact enough and light enough to go on a moving carriage. So I have all these optical arrangements which is quite complex in a compact way. I think that's the, the main achievement. The main responsibility of LASER for this project is to create a bridge. It's um, the main part that will receive all the, let's say, ingredients of the different partners of the project. So what is challenging for this project is that you cannot use uh, fiber optics, which means you have all the optical um, paths which you have to control with uh, rigid part with mirror on mount and so on. So managing a kilowatt beam changed everything. At the end of the project, what we have to do is to uh, first verify that uh, the prototype works as planned and then produce some samples and also to verify that the samples fulfill some mechanical tests. The main challenge was maybe to demonstrate that we have a, let's say, a proper a production rate no? for producing the holes and so far we have demonstrated uh, 150 holes per second uh, drilled on titanium 0.8 8, uh, thickness and um, that, that, that's quite good. We have demonstrated that uh, when increasing the average power of your femtosecond laser you can improve very much the, the ablation rate, I mean the capacity of the laser to remove material very precisely and with good quality. And I think in the future we will see more uh, yeah, laser sources operating at high average power. No? The Multipoint project showed the feasibility of using a femtosecond laser system to micro-drill large titanium panels used in the fabrication of hybrid laminar flow control structures in the aerospace industry. The result will be improved performance and reduced environmental impact, while saving 9% of fuel consumption in future generations of aircraft. <laughs> <laughs>